Welcome back everyone. Number 21 ranked Mizzou baseball looked to bounce back after a series opening loss to Tennessee yesterday. Reigning SEC Pitcher of the Week Tanner Hook was on the mound tonight for the Tigers. Mizzou was behind 2-0 in the second inning, but then Jack Clegg doubled with the bases loaded. And then Jake Ring took a three-run blast over the wall to propel the Tigers further ahead. It's in the ninth right now. Tigers are looking pretty good though, up 7-3. The softball team has only played six of their 33 games at University Field this year, so I'd say they're pretty happy to be back. So is Tori Finucane dealing early, strikes out Amanda Ivey and then Mackenzie Toller, and then it's her defense helping her out. Erica Gall, deep shot to center, but Taylor Gadboyce, look at her grab it from over the wall. And it's a good thing she did that because this game will get tight later on. Tigers didn't get a lot of hits in this game. A little bunt there as Kirsten Mack lays it down. The Bulldogs trouble with it, so Corinne Genovese comes around to score. Mizzou up 1-0. Then it was Amanda Sanchez. Hot shot right up the middle. Julia Eccles couldn't handle it. Emily Crane scores. Tigers up 3-0. They gave up a couple of runs there late, but they hang on for a 3-2 win. Cincinnati Reds pitcher Jason Marquis pitched against his former team tonight in the Cardinals. Marquis spent three years with the Cards before moving on. He hadn't pitched in 21 months because of Tommy John surgery, so he's also certainly happy to be back. Top second, Reds up 2-1, but not for long. Randall Gritchick with Colton Wong on, blasts a two-run homer, his first of the season. 3-2, the score there. Then bottom third, Bird still up, Joey Votto. The guy's on a heater right now. Four homers, eight RBIs to start off the year. Reds now up 4-3. And then bottom eighth, score tied at four. Runners in scoring position. Todd Frazier flies out to Jason Hayward. That throw just not in time. That would be the go-ahead run as the Reds win 5-4. The Royals are just 159 wins away from an undefeated season. It's a ways to go, but, you know, there's still a chance. They got the late night matchup with the Los Angeles Angels in LA. Remember, KC swept them in the postseason last year, so the Angels probably looking for some payback. David Fries, remember back then, compared the Roys to a Mack truck. And that they were. Missouri basketball missed out on another big in state recruit, Jason Tatum from Chaminade in St. Louis, announced that Mizzou is not on his list of potential schools. Tatum is the number one ranked player in the 2016 class. The guy's just a straight up baller. He did, some, he did get some uh, court time at Mizzou Arena when Chaminade took home third place in the state playoffs this year. And a former Mizzou football Tiger announced today he'll be playing professional football. James Franklin posted that he is now a member of the Edmonton Eskimos in the Canadian Football League, not the NFL. Franklin went undrafted in 2014, but he was picked up by the Detroit Lions. They released him at the beginning of the season. That is not his sport but he could probably do both. That's sports.